Renowned as a Dubai icon, the Burj Al Arab commands its own island, providing panoramic views of the vibrant Blue Sea. For exclusive access, often referred to as the only seven-star hotel on Earth, which stands as a pinnacle of luxury situated on a man-made island about 280 meters from the Jumeirah coast, the hotel is linked to the mainland via a private bridge. It houses 199 distinct suites, each attended by a team of eight dedicated staff members. Additionally, the Burj Al Arab boasts six sumptuous restaurants, most notably Al Mahara, renowned for its expansive seawater aquarium. The hotel also features a luxury 10,000 square meter platform with two pools, cabanas, and a 1,120 square meter beach area. The hotel's reputation for luxury and exclusivity has led to the myth of Burj Al Arab being the world's only seven-star hotel. The Burj Al Arab, a luxury hotel in Dubai, is officially rated 5-star deluxe, the highest official ranking. The term 7 stars was introduced by a British journalist during a press trip, describing the hotel's grandiosity. The hotel is owned and managed by the Jumeirah Group, a global luxury hotel company. Nighty rates at the Burj Al Arab start at 4,500 AED, about $1,225 during the low season, but high season rates can be 8,000 AEE, about $2,175. The most luxurious suite, the Royal Suite, is priced at AED 88,000, about $24,000 per night. In 2012, CNN listed the Royal Suite as number 12 among the world's most expensive hotel suites. The hotel offers an upscale experience, but hotel buffs should consider booking a stay to fully experience the luxury of the Burj Al Arab. Current rates and room bookings can be found on the hotel's website. The Burj Al Arab is a luxurious hotel that offers a range of suites, from 170 square meters to 780 square meters, each with its own unique features and amenities. The one-bedroom deluxe suite, Suite 1006, on the 10th floor spans 170 square meters over two floors, offering an imposing feeling of splendor and opulence. The suites are adorned with gold and royal blue tones, creating a sense of opulence and splendor. The ground floor features a guest restroom, writing desk, dining area, private bar, and sitting area, all furnished in gold leaf. The suites range from 170 square meters to an impressive 780 square meters royal suite, each with its own private bar, Hermes amenities, pillow menu, 24 karat gold iPads, virtual concierge, iMac, and plasma screen in every room. The Royal Suite is the ultimate Burj Al Arab experience, featuring a 360-degree revolving bed, a 24-karat gold shower, a cinema, and a private lift. The hotel's commitment to luxury is evident in the fact that the butler presses the doorbell, allowing their face to appear on TVs and ringing a telephone in every room if not answered. The Burj Al Arab Hotel offers a variety of dining options, including seafood served underwater, classic French served in the sky, an Arabic and international buffet, Pan-Asian with 12 live cooking stations, and Mediterranean overwater dining. A two-minute buggy ride to Jumeria Al Masim provides another seven restaurants, including Polynesian, seafood, and Peruvian Nikkei. The world's only seven-star hotel's craftsmanship and luxury are evident on the dining table, with Aircrease silverware Bernardo porcelain, Schott's weasel glassware, and soft table linen. Some of the most popular dishes include the Al Muntaha, located on the 27th floor with panoramic views overlooking the Dubai skyline. The evening starts with a champagne trolley, Dom Perinnen, and Louis Rodera crystal rose offered by the glass. The restaurant also features a chic South Mediterranean dining pop-up on the Burj Al Arab Terrace, offering great food and attentive service while enjoying the sun. Breakfast is served in Bab Al Yam, where guests can choose from a buffet and live cooking stations or order from the a la carte menu while sitting on the terrace next to the ocean. The terrace at the Burj Al Arab is a luxurious leisure facility that offers a private escape with a minibar, espresso machine, and butler. The terrace also features a beach club with embossed Oxford pillows and a falconer on the terrace to avoid disturbing guests. The Talispa, located on the 18th floor of the hotel, is a must-visit for its luxury wellness offerings. Guests can enjoy a dip in the thermal infinity pool or relax in the steam room and sauna, all with panoramic views of the Dubai skyline. 
The therapists quickly build a respectful rapport with guests, understanding their mood and expectations. They provide personalized advice on improving wellness after the treatment. Afternoon tea is a must-try experience at the world's only seven-star hotel, San Eda, where the conversation is more about royal berry caviar, Luis Rodera champagne, and how much gold you want in your tea. The helipad of the Burj Al Arab, sometimes referred to as the most famous helipad in the world, is suspended more than 200 meters above the earth. The main function of the 24-meter-wide helipad is for the hotel's concierge service, which provides Rolls-Royce or helicopter transportation for visitors to and from the airport. The helipad is more well-known, though, for being the venue for several events and stunts. Roger Federer and Andre Gassi engaged in a demonstration match on the world's highest tennis court, which was constructed out of helipad material in 2005. There, Rory McIlroy and Tiger Woods struck a golf ball. One driver, David Kulfer, performed donuts on the helipad of the Burj Al Arab in 2014. A few years later, someone built a ring, and Anthony Joshua had a sparring match up there. In 2019, BMX cyclist Chris Kyle made a helipad leap from a helicopter. And atop its helipad, the Burj Al Arab had its first ever art exhibition recently. Every person you come across radiates a palpably positive sense of pride and evident love for what they do. The world's only seven-star hotel places a strong emphasis on its people and the innovation and authenticity they bring to the table, with a staff-to-guest ratio of 6 to 1. There is an incredibly strong emotional bond formed with its inhabitants, despite the striking levels of grandeur and richness that the symbol of Dubai triumphantly provides. Their passion and gracious, modest character create a connection that you will want to repeat again and again. Because of this, the Burj Al Arab is the only seven-star hotel in the world.